Hi guys, in this video I want to very quickly show you how to get to the SQL view, SQL view, so you can type your SQL code using Microsoft Access. So in case you missed it in one of my lo more long drawn out videos, this one is a short and sweet, maybe under a minute, let's see if we can do that, uh, video to just show you how to get there. So uh, we have the ribbons up here, go over to create choose query design so let me choose query design close out the table because this is going to take you into the design view of of microsoft access uh, where you're going to use its kind of graphic user interface we don't want if you don't want to use that and you want to use sql obviously that's why you're watching this video close that out so sorry i closed out too much so create Query design, close that out. Then, don't close this out like I just did. Go over to the top left and you'll either see SQL, if not, click on this arrow and you'll see SQL view. Click on this and you'll see a nice select uh, statement uh, and a semicolon kind of ready for you to type your SQL code. So you can actually access SQL here. If the font is too small, go to File, Options, Object Designers, and increase the font size. Mine was like at 8, I think by default 10, something like that. Changed it to 14 so you guys could see it. But if uh, you want to change yours, that's how you do it. So that's how you access the SQL view. Once you've typed your code, you can run your code. Uh, and you can see the results of your your work and then when you're done you can close it out and save the results of your query if you wish and okay so uh, that's all uh, make sure to comment subscribe and watch the watch the more lo uh, long uh, drawn out videos where I actually show you how to uh, uh, some SQL and I uh, start with the most basic discussion with about databases start with the most basic SQL code in part two and then build up on and on all the way on up I have as many parts to that series so subscribe share like comment until next time have a great day